Welcome back to Sister Circle Live. We say this all the time. Mm. All of you watching us at home are why do we do this show? So with that being said, we want to talk directly to those who love us like we love them. Absolutely. So it's time for a segment we like to call Ask the Sisters. So Quad, tell us what our first question is. All okay. right, let me see. All right, it says Trina, hey. mm. loving the natural uh -huh. hair. What inspired you to go on this journey? Come on. Come on. Well, you know, I've attempted for a while to wear my natural hair mm -hmm. to no avail. Right. And then my husband said, "Why don't you just wear it? Is this you?" I was like, "Oh, okay, I'll try it." And remember, we did a um, a full circle, mm -hmm. and I was like, "I've come to the conclusion I will never wear my mm -hmm. natural hair." And then you know what? I would just said, "This is just me." Just. I love it. I think it's Trina. beautiful. I love it. It's freedom. It is free. It's freedom, man. And, it really and is. And it's beautiful. It's coming out of your scalp. God yeah. made it. <laughs> Hello, All of that. All of that. And you're fine, Steve. Oh, I appreciate it. Thank <laughs> you, Kylie. Thank you, Kylie. <laughs> Almost slapped on the wig, but I did. Uh, well. <laughs> ain't nothing wrong with a little piece of wig, too, child. Yeah, ain't nothing wrong All with right, a piece well, of wig. All right, well, let's go. What else are people, the people, people asking? asking? Okay. Sonia M said, Selena, I love the new album. Will you be having any more shows anytime soon? Mm -hmm. Well, child, according to the coronavirus, uh, <laughs> <laughs> the way it's set up, you know, I had a couple already lined up that they've already been, you know, postponing and moving. Yeah. So, yes, I, of course, I plan to have a million shows if I can this year, but it's really going right, to be yeah. based on, you know, the health and safety of our community and our right. nation. So right. that comes first, and then come the show. Yeah. But thank you for uh, loving the album, because yes. uh, it is lit. Thank you. Absolutely. All right, let's see what the people are asking. Miss okay. Quad, I always see you turning up to good music on the Instagram story. I know I do, <laughs> I do, I do. So I have to ask, what's your favorite song, artist, and artist at this moment? Ooh. Listen, okay, I got a new one. Uh, <laughs> oh, this one is from uh, 1976. Listen, I just actually, somebody put me up on this mm -hmm. the other night. Uh oh. Did I say put me up put, on this? Put, put, put you up, up on, on it. it. Put me put on you. game. The other night, and his name is Pink Sweat. My God. And it's it. the song is just truly, it's 17, it's called 17 again. It is so beautiful. So mm. get into it, really, really, really look at uh, and listen at the lyrics. If you can pull it up with the lyrics, it is so beautiful. I just absolutely love it. What genre is it? It's actually like, um, it's, it's, it's a love song. So is it a slow it's, song? It's R&B, R&B yeah. slow song? But it's kind of like pop a little bit. What do we call that? Oh, it could be a R mid? Uh, pop and R&B. Pop and B? There it is. <laughs> there you go. R&B. Pop pop? What's, what, what's your favorite? Um, right now, you who know, are you listening to? First of all, the woman album. That is true. <laughs> but beyond the woman album, um, I can't remember his last name right now. I don't know why I drawn a blank, but his first name is Kevin. I think it's Ross. Kevin Ross? Yes. Kevin Ross, mm -hmm. Let It Out. The song's called Let It Out. Uh huh. I turn up on that song pretty much every morning. Really? Yes. Wow. It's, it starts my workout. What do you like about it? Well, his entire EP is dope. Okay. okay? Um, he was on our show before, mm -hmm. and you know he does all these cool internet. You know how he does like the squares and stuff, and you sing to yourself. You have a background, so he's mm -hmm. an ex he's an excellent vocalist and writer. But I just love how. He utilizes his voice in many different yes, tones. I know exactly who you're talking about. Oh my God, I yes. love, I really love him right now. Like I love him and I love Luke James' new album. Yes. It's very lit, it's very Marvin Gaye-esque. Mm. And I love Marvin Gaye. That's yeah. Cool. Yes, very yeah. Marvin Gaye-esque. Yeah. Okay. So, yeah. mm -hmm. What about you, Tree? Oh, there's a song out right now from Julia Michaels and it's a duet with Jax something, Sex something. Mm -hmm. And it was, I, I hate to say that this is the name of it, but if the world ended, mm -hmm. oh my but God. no, but That's it's, it's super cool song? because they used to date, and they don't date anymore. But if it was like if the world ended, but you're still gonna come and see me, right? Oh, it's it's so uh, like so. If the world ended, you'd be the last person. Yes, that would come. it's like. Mm. We have any more questions? It's, oh, it's, dope. it's, so, it's so dope. It's okay, D-O-B-E, yes. Yeah, yeah. Let's see what June E say. She said, what is your favorite segment of the show? Who would you love to interview on the show that has not yet visited the show? Ooh, Ooh. can I go first? Yes, ma'am. So the person that I would like to have here is Tyler Perry. Yes. And my favorite segment is, and another thing. And another yeah. thing. I love another thing. So that, I think that would be that for me. 
Um, I agree with Tyler Perry. I agree That's with him one. down to the ground. I would also love to see, I love if Eddie Murphy could come here. <gasps> Wouldn't oh that my be super God. funny? When I tell you he's my favorite comedian in history. Yes. history. Him and Martin Lawrence, and I'm, I'm okay. Oh, and Will Smith. Yes. But, um, oh, Will Smith. Will Smith, Smith is what I'm trying to tell you. <laughs> um, one of my favorite segments is Cooking with Miss Kwan. <gasps> yeah, that's oh, a good one, too. And we get to eat and drink, and to eat and drink too, yeah. <laughs> what are we doing? You guys are like eating and drinking? We're all here. I got to say, Octavia Spencer, of course, will be one. <gasps> oh, I yes, would another absolutely one. love to interview yeah, her. Um, Ava DuVernay is another. Oh, I yes, would absolutely yes, love to one. interview her. And my favorite segment, you know, we just have so many good segments here. We really do. Um, I like... And another thing, I like gossip when we do our thing mm -hmm. with, um, what is it, Spittling the Tea with Miss Squad? I think that's it's what it's Danny called. Danny Canada. Mm -hmm. Dan, mm -hmm. I think that's what it's called. I've been mm -hmm. here for three years. Now. Dish and tea, Still dish thinking. and tea with Miss Squad. That's, that's one of my called. favorite segments. I well. like that one, and I, I really just enjoy our guests. Our, our guests are so amazing here. I really just mm -hmm. kind of love diving into what they have going on. Mm -hmm. so, Super fun. Yeah. I like when we sit at the table. I like when we sit all day. I think, can we take one, can we, yeah. can we take one more? Yeah. Okay. okay, take one more. Okay, Cicely M. For each of the ladies, since you work in an environment that is critical of appearance, how do you deal with it and keep your confidence intact? Mm. Also, share tips on what you can do for self-care. Girl! Ooh. Uh, first of all, we have an amazing glam squad we here. Do, we uh, do. do. Uh, Robin Mykia stylist, Facial stylist, mm -hmm. Kelvin Myers makeup, Jay Nice makeup, Dawn on hair. Okay, so our glam squad is dope. They yes. keep us fly. Absolutely. Um, and then for self-care, I am an Epsom salt Mm. Candles and music, Candles. girl. I will dim a light down, Ooh. honey, and get down to a soaker tub. I know yes. that's right. Ooh. And get my entire life together and reset myself. So Dang. that's my favorite self-care tool. What about you, Quad? You know I get my weekly massages. Mm. You sure enough do that. I, I, I have to. I get my weekly massages. I too. have to. And she's do she does very well. Shouts out to Ashley, girl. <laughs> I'll see you on Monday. Uh-huh. <laughs> yes. I, I do I love that. And I love a good cow gun bath. I, I love I still, a good And bath. I, you know, bubble me baths, me cow gun. And, and you know what? I actually use Skin So Soft, yes. Avon. I do, I do too. She's I do. Yeah, you know, she's from 1957. She is Madam C.J. Walker. That's right. That's right. Um, nice. Two things. I love a candle in a book. Ooh. And a glass of wine with it. Oh, throw it, some wine in it, man, th th too. Throw some, oh, I had some, a nice some wine in it. And as far as what people say about my parents, I like me, so, um, what you think about me is not my personal business. It's Ooh. not. It's not my business. It's I business. like that one. It's I like that business. one. Well, we also always love. We always love hearing from you. So send us your questions at Sister Circle TV on all social media platforms. And guess what? We'll be right back. We sure will. Awesome.